Jide, thank you for joining us uh, tonight. Let's begin with Nigeria. Uh, what can the nation expect in Oregon after, of course, the news that we heard uh, that the country's women's 4 by 100 meters relay team will not be taking part in the competition? Well, thank you very much. Uh, it's quite unfortunate that uh, Nigeria will, be, will not be taking part in the uh, four by 100 meters relay events, um, especially in the women's, yeah, women's event, because uh, um, one would have expected that uh, the performance at the last African championship in Mauritius, uh, that sort, um, the women's uh, win gold medal would have, uh, would have been like um, a dress rehearsal for what should the, the country should be expecting at uh, the world championship. But unfortunately, because of what happened at the Olympics to one of the Nigeria's athletes, blessing Okawari, Nigeria will be missing out, uh, even though um, going through some of the lists that has been released by the Athletics Federation of Nigeria, they are still hopeful, thinking that miracle can happen. But the way it is now, especially from the end of the Athletics Integrity Unit, it, it means that uh, uh, nothing is going to happen from uh, Nigeria's side. But, but most of us who have followed athletics uh, in Nigeria would not be surprised because uh, it has been um, like a, a comsi comsa situation, especially in the relay events. Um, the country athletes or the, the relay events most times are always unstable. They, um, of course, even before uh, Nigeria could qualify for uh, the Olympics, uh, the relay events, it took so much time. Um, we had to wait till they uh, almost at the tail end of uh, the qualifiers to be able to make it. But right. uh, maybe in other events, but the way it is now, Nigeria, Nigerians are already, uh, most of them have already put that behind them. Maybe the next, <laughs> the next world championship it might happen, but Did not this one. All right, uh, Jide, let's look at the wider picture across Africa then. I'm going to put you on the spot here. Where do you see most of Africa's medals coming from in Oregon? Well, of course, uh, where else? Maybe. Of course, we've seen most of uh, uh, Nigeria. The, 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 we've seen some fantastic performance by some African athletes in the sprints, especially from the likes of Kenya, Ferdinand, or, or Mayala, um, not forgetting what uh, Akane Simbeni of South Africa also can do. And uh, from the women's side, uh, there is the fact that Talu is also another, another uh, athlete, uh, woman athlete that one should expect to do, to do uh, Africa proud. Uh, but but uh, if, like you've said, putting me on the spot, I will, the focus right now will be on the distance uh, um, races, uh, you know, the long distance races like the marathon, the 1,500, the steeplechase, the 10,000, the 5,000, and uh, who are those that are the likely um, uh, or the usual suspects? You begin to look at uh, Beatrice from, 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 from Kenya, for example, uh, Ruth Chepengetic and Timothy, Chariot, and th there are lots of uh, uh, Helen O'Beary. These are the, you know, especially reigning champions that, uh, of course, they are, the t they are the athletes to beat. Of course, you, I just, uh, I listened to uh, watch that report from Uganda, and I'm, I'm already with what they did to, in 2019 in uh, Uganda. They want to better that particular performance. And uh, the East Africans, uh, with a sprinkle of uh, some uh, North Africans that already have done fantastic in this season in their various events. Um, I think if you talk about the long distance, that is where the, the medals will be coming. Don't forget that, uh, like I said, Kenya were second to United States at Indoa. Right. And uh, I don't see them losing focus. I don't see, I know on the price. I, I will give it to them. All right. All right. Jide, thank you very much for speaking to us on Sports Scene tonight. Jide Olaniran, who's a sports analyst, joining us live there from Lagos, Nigeria.